Ladies, let me put you on my, what I like to call, marry me casserole. Now I say this because I used to make this for my husband when we were just dating and I feel like it literally convinced him to marry me because it's so damn good. Here's what you'll need, very easy. Butter, you only need half stick. Cheddar cheese, whichever one you prefer. Two bags of broccoli florets. I just use the Walmart brand. Two cans cream of chicken soup. A little bit of mayonnaise. I use light because it makes me feel like I'm eating healthy even though I know I'm not. Chicken broth. Again, I use reduced sodium because it makes me feel like I'm being healthy even though I'm not. And then however you like your chicken, rotisserie is easiest just because I pick it off and it's already shredded. I mean, I don't have to cook it because it's already cooked. But I also sometimes will buy like th two or three chicken breasts, boil them and shred them up. And the icing on the cake, the star of the show, savory herbs, stovetop stuffing. It's not going to be what you think it is. All right, first step, we are going to do 350 and we're going to preheat that oven. And then you just shred your chicken. I just obviously used rotisserie, like I said before, so it's just in that bowl. And then for this bowl, you're going to add your two cans of cream of chicken. And then how I like to measure out my chicken broth is I just fill up the can that the cream of chicken came in, I'm being messy, because that's exactly how much you need. And then I dump that in there. And then you'll add two thirds cup of mayonnaise. And then technically you're supposed to do a half cup of the cheese, but I like to measure with my heart. Seems about right. Okay. And it looks questionable, but you mix it together, obviously. And then it looks like this delicious mixture. And then I'm cooking my broccoli, both of the bags. I put them in for six minutes each. Once your broccoli is cooked, I just use a 9 by 13 dish, um, and I, you just spread it across the bottom evenly. And then you're going to take your chicken and just spread it evenly across the broccoli. And once you do that, you're going to take your mixture and pour it across that and spread that evenly. So that's what that looks like, spread across evenly, and I'm melting my butter. While the butter's melting, you're going to take your stuffing mix and spread that across it evenly. It's obviously not cooked just straight from the bag. And once that is on there, you're going to take your melted butter and I just drizzle it evenly. And it's now assembled. I just top it with some tin foil. And you put it in the oven with the tin foil for 45 minutes. I didn't get to finish, but you do the next 15 minutes without the foil. And my husband and his friend literally finished the whole entire thing. And me, of course.